We'll talk more in a minute. Thanks. With Sandy and Irene still fresh in most of our minds here in Connecticut, there is a lot of preparation underway right now, just in case we do have a brush with this storm. News Ace Bob Wilson is live for us in East Hartford, where some old infrastructure could be put to the test. Bob? Yeah, you know what? They're taking a look at it right now. I'm on top of a levee here in East Hartford, and you can see over here there's they're actually protecting buildings. The Connecticut River is on one side, and the buildings are on the other side right here. That's what it's protecting. And we want to say, you know, they've been out here inspecting, looking at the pumps and everything just in case. And they say this could turn out to be just a dry run, but they're ready if it comes. East Hartford has four miles of levees and dikes. It's the front lines, the flood protection from storm surge and quickly rising waters of the Connecticut River. The mayor called the monthly meeting in the Emergency Operations Center to make sure the city is ready. A hurricane is one of the few events that you actually have time to plan. You know, we know that it's it's days days off. It gives us time to look and go, okay, where are we at? What resources do we need? What facilities do we need to shore up? Hartford has several pumping stations, one on the north side of the city, this one on the south side of the city, trying to keep the water back into the Connecticut River. And there's a lot of infrastructure to maintain. The pumps inside there are over 50 years old, and you can just tell when you look at it, that it needs to be maintained. The city says they are ready, they've been on top of it, and if Joaquin decides to drop a lot of water in a short amount of time, these pumps can handle it. The pump stations were built back in the 30s, and we have a, a pretty significant protocol on maintenance, on testing, operations, so we're constantly out there training with our guys, making sure that the equipment works. City leaders say the levees and dikes are on the front lines, but they're also looking at the entire drainage system. Because Hartford Mayor Pedro Segarra says, while we may not take a direct hit from the eye, Joaquin can bring a lot of rain. We have been taking some precautionary measures in terms of, you know, clearing some of the uh, some of the drain systems and and the uh, uh, tributaries into our Connecticut River. Make sure the uh, pump stations are operational. And they're ready. They say, you know, what, if it's a dry run, if it misses us completely, if the sun is shining outside instead, they're happy. They'll be ready for the next one. We're live in East Hartford. Bob Wilson, News 8.